It is an honor that certainly puts you in a league with legends. Tonight, the Grand Ole Opry inducts its 230th cast member. And this induction is a special one. News Channel 5's Forrest Sanders takes us backstage to explain why. And the reason, honest to God, that I'm still doing this, I always made sure I didn't have anything to fall back on. <laughs> How do you even begin to sum up 60 yeah, years of entertainment? Years from comedian and musician okay. Gary Mule D. Well, you can't, but you can pick a few bright spots. I, uh, Gary was on Johnny Carson. He was a judge on The Gong Show. He opened for acts including Merle Haggard, Willie Nelson, Frank Sinatra. His Nashville career included being a cast member on Hee Haw and more than 160 appearances on the Grand Ole Opry. Gary's advice to fellow comedians is simple. And all I ever say is, don't say anything unless it's funny. Just out walking around the parking lot. It's windy out there. Years ago, Gary decided comedy clubs weren't right for his style. The Opry, though, that's his crap. And I always like to work for families. I like to hear people say, we never saw mom and dad laugh like that. All these photographs are arranged in a smile, not by accident. In the comedy dressing room, vice president and executive producer of the Opry, Dan Rogers, explains Gary is now part of a long tradition of greats. There's something really special about Grandpa Jones and Minnie Pearl. And yet, the Opry went for 50 years without inducting another comedian as a cast member. For all that time, the last one was Jerry Clower in 1973. Oh, I love y'all. But that wait is over. Last month, we talked to comedian Henry Cho about becoming Opry member 229. Yeah, we're the torchbearers. And now Gary becomes member 230. He's 83, one year older than Bugs Bunny and two years younger than Porky Pig. And in a long career, Nashville has brought Gary some incredible moments, meeting Minnie Pearl in her last years. She was bedridden at that time. She'd seen me on TNN. She said, sit, I sit here on the bed. I sat on the bed beside her. She held my hand. That She loved the way I did my comedy. My God, what an icon. This induction was another of those incredible moments. But when it hit me, it really hit me. It's going to be the pinnacle of my career. I'm Forrest Sanders, News Channel 5. Well deserved. Yeah, it is quite an honor too.